so this is day one and here you can see the display is on if i remove the key the display doesn't turns off itself so this is the issue which happened with me and i will show you how i solved it for now you can see the display is working normally but the key is not inserted so it won't turn off ever so let's see how i solved it so for this issue we reached out to customer care and for the first time they said wait for 24 hours and it will solve automatically but we waited for 24 hours but after 24 hours it didn't solve the screen was on for more than 24 hours then we again called them and then they said go to nearby mechanic and with the help of them open the front panel you can see this front panel was open and this panel was also open so that it comes out so and they said to remove this lock you can see this is the lock which is here like this here like this so what happened actually is uh, for some reason water went through this and entered in this cap so actually it's like this the cap is like this here this plastic case is here and another there is a rubber cap but for some reason the water also reached inside this cap so what we did we opened this cap and you can see here is some rusting you can see on this wire so it was whole rusted so we used some petrol to clean this and dried it with high pressure air so it just cleaned out and you can see now there is only a little bit rust and it's a clean so we just uh, put it back normally and the issue was solved so for your testing so for now i will show you how it was solved so for what what was happening that if we plug this cable here this is the cable for key if we plugged it here the display used to start automatically but now it's not starting because we don't have any key inserted here so what we will do we will put key in here and turn on so let me show you so you can see it's plugged in and now we can turn on you can see the display is on so i will turn it off again and the display is off so the issue was only that for some reason the water went inside this and it got shorted so the display was turning on automatically and the switch was not responding as it was shorted and it was bypassed automatically so you can also solve your issue by doing this same thing but before that do reach customer care so that your warranty doesn't void thank you for seeing the video if you like my video subscribe to my channel for more content